Indoor and outdoor businesses may open at 50% of capacity as Metro Manila and other areas are downgraded to alert level 2. JP Nunez will give us the details live. Yes, JP. Arlene, good evening. With the increase of operating capacity in indoor businesses under alert level 2 restrictions, store owners and managers expect to regain their loss from the previous stricter restriction. Business indoor, op indoor operation under alert level 2 is increased up to 50% capacity and 70% for outdoor services. A coffee shop in Quezon City can now accommodate twice the number of their customers for indoor services. From accommodating more than 20 customers under alert level 3, they can now accept more than 40 individuals with the easing of restriction to alert level 2 starting today. Sa ngayon po, baka kaya, kakayanin na po siya ng mga 50 person to 60 person po. Dito po kasi sir, ah, kumbaga, sa isang branch po namin, maliit po kasi siya. So, dito ang, ang kakayanin lang po talaga, ang pinakamagami na po is ah, dumating is 40 person lang po talaga. Customers who accompany kids and those partially vaccinated individuals are now free to travel as mobility restrictions for unvaccinated individuals is lifted. A restaurant in Marikina City also expects their regular customers will return with their families and their children as minors were not restricted. An eat-all-you-can restaurant in Paranaque City, which also has branches around Metro Manila, will now accept their employees who are relieved during stricter alert level restriction. Arthur Benedicto, the operations manager of Cabalen Group of Companies, said some of their branches were forced to shut down due to pandemic. Some of their employees were relieved from work and finds another job aside from small medium or aside from small medium enterprise. Even larger businesses asking the government for assistance caused by pandemic. So sana uh, bigyan kami ng O, ng government ng tulong para naman makabawi kasi talagang lumubog lahat ng halos lahat ng restaurant dito sa sa ating sa ating bansa talagang we are the first I think na apektado talaga dito sa pandemic na to. Sana naman lang uh, the government will uh, support us or like in the form of tax uh, baka pwedeng wala muna kaming tax na bayaran for this pandemic or uh, in a form of loan para makabawi naman kami sa business na zero interest, something like that. Arlene, business owners and managers hope that there will be no more lockdown imposed and the threat of COVID-19 will finally end this year. That is our latest live. Back to you, Arlene. Thank you, JP Nunez reporting live from Quezon City.